trivialized by the sounds of it. Uh, no, that's very exciting to check out. Uh, now, while we're still here, let's go ahead and check out the, the new artifact that's going to be arriving. Um, we love getting the chance artifact, to show baby. all of you folks this early, so you can go ahead and start your build crafting. Um, but, uh, but Chris, you know, I know obviously last time around, if I had to kind of paint it with a meta, meta I'd say rather, it'd be very focused on sniper rifles, solar. Um, if there was a similar theme for this particular artifact, what would it be? So it goes very hard into stasis. Yeah. Like touches all of the stasis verbs. Uh, if you want to make a stasis build, you can amplify it in a bunch of ways. Yeah. 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 Uh, we're also um, adding a bunch of grenade launcher perks. Uh, so we've got uh, overload grenade launchers, which is great. Like taking those uh, like super deadly overload champions. Yeah. Um, like also bringing like back 2. a variant 0. of uh, like everyone's favorite grenade launcher yeah. uh, artifact perk, Breach and Clear. Oh, yes. Um, yeah. So you can weaken enemies, uh, and then when you boost it, you can get the, the second part of that old perk. Um, nice. We were yeah. saying earlier, you can boost artifact perks with the um, potion system. That's right, yeah. Good. I also will admit I'm very selfishly excited to see Anti-Barrier Scout Rifle back. It's yeah. been so long. Anti-Barrier Scout I've missed it. Barrier Scout is great. I'm going to pretend like that's just for me, for my own benefit <laughs> today. We're trying something a bit different with this artifact as Use well. That that. The so the, the first column is all uh, anti-champion mods, yeah. and the final column is all of the, the pinnacle ones, like the capstones for your artifact. Build. Right, yeah, yeah. But columns two, three, and four are roughly equivalent in power, which will let you mix and match them more freely instead of feeling like you have to like go for the, the top-tier ones. They're all... Right. Um, usable yeah. uh, in builds. It's less of a, a linear escalation and more of just a mix and match in a lot right. of ways. And guys, Very I'm exciting. making a Saint-14 okay. uh, So there'll be plenty of opportunities right for now. players to go ahead and amplify season their builds, go ahead and really lean season, into one guys. play style if, again, you're like me and want to run double grenade Saint launchers. Guns, this feels like a remarkably great season to be doing that, especially with the Fighting Lion buff. Thank yeah. you for sharing that with us. <laughs> um, but I believe that actually wraps us up for this particular segment uh, of Onslaught, but there's also a couple more things that I wanted to go ahead and tease for the arrival of Act 1. Um, for starters, an old favorite strike is going to be making its return. The inverted spire is returning. Uh, but Clayton, it's not coming back exactly as people remember it, is it? Spire. Nope. We're, we're taking an approach and uh, adjusting all the encounters. Yeah. And uh, you'll see more effects yes. than what you're used That's to. true. I can confirm. My compatriot on the social media team, Mitch, showed me through it a little bit. Uh, the only thing I'll spoil is if you like death lasers going to have a great time out there. Uh, and then in addition to that, there's a, one more thing we wanted to add in. Arriving with Act 2, mind you, of Revenant, um, a, and I'm going to read this to make sure I get it right, uh, a, uh, a inspired from a fan favorite activity from Destiny's Past. We're going to go ahead and bring back an activity, but we're not going to tell you anything outside of that. So chat, speculate, let us know what you think. Go ahead and shout us out uh, on Twitter or wherever it is you like to hang out online. Um, but... Uh, with that, um, I think we're going ahead and ready to get ready, pardon me, for the next segment. But in the meantime, 